with nine UFC bonuses to his credit. Here is the Sao Paulo native, Charles Du Bronx Oliveira, repping Macaco Gold Team, training out of Houston, Texas, and coming up on 20 UFC appearances. Here's a guy, Joe, who debuted with a lot of hype right out of high school, 20 years old, made his UFC debut. It was a good one against Darren Elkins, has gone on to beat the likes of Hatsu Hiyoki, Jeremy Stevens, no denying the credentials of this Brazilian jiu-jitsu black belt, Charles Du Bronx Oliveira. This guy has tremendous ground technique and his ability to pass guard and get to a dominant position is elite. Ah, yes, here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and as Dana White calls him, the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee making the walk tonight. You can make the argument no man has had as much of an influence on UFC fighters as Bruce Lee has. Quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. Man, it would have been great to see what Bruce Lee could have done inside the UFC. He is making the walk tonight. This guy has outstanding defense. And having that type of skill, knowing that you can protect yourself and yet still land devastating blows of your own, it is a distinct advantage. And now our kill of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Three years apart, with some differences in height and a similar reach. We send it inside the octagon to Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening and when the action begins our referee in charge of the octagon eve loving and now this is the moment ufc fans around the world have been waiting for live from the mgm grand garden arena in las vegas Introducing folks, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a jiu-jitsu fighter, holding a professional record of 25 wins, 8 losses, and 1 no contest. He stands 5 feet 10 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Houston, Texas, Charles Dupont. And now with his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 7 inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! Okay, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is gonna go down right now. And we are underway. All right, here's Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles. And it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. All right, first round is underway. We'll see how long it takes for him to find a home for these patented, powerful overhand punches. Always a big weapon of his on fight night. We'll see how soon he can get it going tonight. Oh, blocks that kick to the body, Joe. Tags him with a flush left. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Oliveira. This is a this is a bit of a chess battle here. Yeah. 
Joe, you gotta fault the strategy here. I'm not saying he bet on the opponent, but he's moving right into that straight punch and right into his opponent's striking range. He would be wise to get his head off of the center line and stop leaning in. Lands a punch. He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. Oh, that's it! Kick lands. Nice jab there by Lee. Lands an inside leg kick, Joe. Just over two minutes, round one. Oh, he missed that kick. Effective strike there by Lee. Oh, what a kick. Under two minutes to go in a back and forth first round here. Oliveira gets caught with that punch. Look at that, he's timing that jab. And he eats a kick. Just missed with the straight left hand. Tagged him. Both fighters exchange in the pocket here. Found the target there, Joe. Nice punch. Oh, brilliant. Oh, I love it. Huge kick misses. Inside leg kick is there by Lee. Trying to find a home for that right hand. Well, he eats a punch to the head there, Joe, and he would be wise to get his head off of that center line. It's almost as if he's moving straight into that punch. Just out of range with that right hook. Lee's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Ten seconds to go. That was a nice jab. The horn sounds for the end of round one. All right, take a seat. Deep breath. Breathe. Take a drink. All right, here we go. Listen, you're doing absolutely awesome. Watch the punt. Let's take a look at it again here. And here's another clean shot that lands. And another perfectly placed strike. Lots of action in that round. Brittany Palmer is in the building. Here we go with round two. All right, so here we go with round two. We'll see if these fighters get after it. You saw at the beginning of round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Entertaining round, don't get me wrong, but we will see here in round two if there's an uptick in the aggression on both sides. Well, the offense has been there. He is landing some good shots, but not really stringing them together and putting combinations on his opponent. He's got to mix up his strikes, change his tempo a little bit, 
and try to get his opponent out of there by landing more than just one strike at a time. Back to the left hand now, but unable to connect, Joe. Oliveira's lower jaw looking extremely swollen now. Well, his opponent's got the read now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to continue to be vulnerable to that counter. Oh, caught him with the head kick. Huge block there. Lands a jab. Going to the body there with the right kick. Well, he's always working off of that jab. Nice jab there by Oliveira. a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. Constantly a moving target. Back to the left hand now, unable to connect. Clean inside leg kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. it up on the right there to no avail. Nice right hand. Very nice. Really swung for the fences with that hook, but misses. Oh, a huge block there. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here. And as a result, he has taken control of this second round. And just misses with that big right hand. Oh! Head kick. How about that shin? This is a huge hook to the head. Overhand right. Hurt him with that spinning back fist. Just out of range with that left hook. Oh, and he lands another strike to the body. Not a ton of real estate there, but he certainly found it. Big kick to the head. He is stunned. He's got him hurt here. Just misses with the straight left hand. All right, 45 seconds now to go in the round. He lands the head kick. Really swung everything into that kick, but fell short. seconds left to go in round two. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. And that's the end of round number two. All right, so there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he registered two big knockdowns. Huge round from Lee. Two big knockdowns and a very, very dangerous fight for his opponent. Here's a perfect kick to the body. Here's a perfectly placed kick that results in a knockdown. Here's a devastating kick that results in a knockdown. 
Ariane Celeste is with us. Are you ready? You ready? Third round underway. He's definitely going to want to start this round off fast to try to pick up where he left off. His opponent was in big trouble at the end of that round. Well, he might be working towards an attritive knockout here tonight as he continues to pepper that body. Look at those numbers, bottom of your screen. That has been the most significant stat in this fight. The body strikes landed for this young man, working here towards the best performance of his UFC career. Couldn't agree with you more. Man, I could watch this guy all day. He continues to land a high number of strikes, just as he did in the previous round. And at least to my amateur eyeballs, Joe, he's not showing any signs of slowing down tonight. Attempt oh! This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. He's in big, big trouble here. tonight by Oliveira. Watch the shot here, Joe. Well, this is live in real time. We didn't hit the replay button. Again, he gets cracked to the head because, again, he's leaning in, almost moving right into his opponent's striking range. And he landed the right hand there. Just missed with the huge kick. Going to the body there with the right kick. Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that he Wow! He is rocked. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. Oh! Just reached the midpoint of the fight. A big kick, but miss. Fight here under two to go. That one appeared to stun him. He's in a lot of trouble. Oh, oh, my, God. God. oh my goodness. Really threw a lot of power into that uppercut, but missed. Tries a big hook to the head, but misses. Oliveira gets hit by that leg kick. seconds to go in the round. Looking to set up that head kick again. This one does not find the hole. 
Oh, man. The punch coming, it's blocked. Final seconds of round three. Oh, nice jab there by Lou. And that'll do it, 15 minutes in the books. This round. Start mixing up your attacks. And here a big shot lands and a knockdown. And here another big shot lands and another knockdown. And here another clean shot lands and another knockdown. What an action-packed round. It looked like it almost ended on multiple occasions. Are you ready? Are you ready? Fourth round now, fight scheduled for five five-minute rounds. Well, just as he did in the previous round, continuing to land a high number of strikes here, and he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down. Scary, scary proposition for the opponent. Oh! He's lost! Oh! What a leg kick! Hard Superman punch! Straight right hand, no good. Joe, huge block there. The defense is holding up. He lands a Superman punch. He caught that one right on the knee. That could have hurt. So, Joe, yet again, he moves right into that straight punch, and these are really starting to add up. He's going to have to figure some things out defensively, lean on the corner a little bit, but ultimately just move that upper body and move those feet, get that head off the center line. Nice punch there. Wow. Oh! Superman punch lands, Joe. You can tell he's worked on that. Just over three minutes now to go. Wow. Oliveira gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. He eats a, ni a nice right hand. Oh, slips the punch there, Joe. And just inches away from landing one of those big right hands. Uppercut misses. Nice jab. Oh! What a leg kick! Oh! Big left hand! Oh, massive kick! Didn't see that one coming. He's badly, badly hurt. And there he swung with the haymaker. Oh, he 
they landed another great shot to the body. They're really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Beautiful technique on the straight right hand. Body kick now by Lee. Back and forth we go. High kick. with that one. Roundhouse Whoa. kick gets through. Oh. Twenty seconds to go. He hurt him with that hook. Ten seconds remaining here in round four. knockout for the KO victory as the round was ending. Wow, an unbelievable result here tonight. Just before the end of that round, a huge shot that drops his opponent and ultimately spells the end of the fight. Referee jumps in there furiously to stop the fight. That is a crazy, crazy knockout just at the end of the round. Great angle here. And he's out. And there he is after a massive knockout here tonight. Near perfect execution and a seminal moment for him here in the Octagon tonight. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Levine has called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 58 seconds of round number four. He's playing the winner by knockout, Bruce Contrano so the legend Bruce Lee does it again. That was a prime performance out of the martial arts legend tonight. This man, of course, has had no shortage of challengers since coming to the UFC. And more often than not, he has had an answer for all styles. Bruce Lee with authority is your winner here tonight.